Hey guys, Fireboy Stoker here, but you may also know me simply as Jason. Well, my as well address this as it's the main focal point of this video. Why haven't I been posting any videos on the channel as of late? As a lot of you may have noticed, I haven't posted a single video on this channel, at the very least it's hard me posting this video, for 4-5 to five months now. Now you may be wondering, why? Why is it that I haven't been active within almost half this year? Besides making occasional commentary posts every once in a while to let you guys know what's been going on in my personal life as of late, of course. Well, the answer, or I guess one of the answers, would be due to me feeling like I no longer have fun when it comes to making or posting videos. Hence, the reason as to why the name of this video is called Burnt Out. I've just been feeling so burnt out over making any type of content within the past year or so that I've gotten little to no motivation to keep making content due to it feeling like, at least to me, not that satisfying as it used to be. To be honest, I currently feel like if I'm not satisfied with a video or potential video idea, I'll just won't post anything. It also doesn't help that as of late, I've been thinking of starting over from fresh by unlisting most, if not all, of my previous content, due to me feeling like they're not the best quality wise and honestly feel really embarrassed at some of my older videos. But I suppose only time will tell if I'll go through with pretty much nuking my entire channel. Granted, in the nearby future that if this were to occur, I will make a playlist consisting of all my old content, with all of them being enlisted for anyone curious enough to look at my old videos. No promises though, because why make promises if you know you can't keep them? Now, I guess it's time for me to list the various reasons to why I haven't been so active on my channel like I used to. Starting with... Reason number one, general content burnout. As I stated earlier, I've been feeling burnt out for the past year or so. Due to a combination of lack of motivation, general laziness and apathy, no drive to make content, etc. And overall, just an insignificant amount of fun and happiness when it comes to making videos. Reason number two, mood. As of now, my usual mood when it comes to potentially making new content is, let's just say, unwilling. I usually just brush it off to save for later, only for me to completely forget the entire idea by the next day. Dad and sleep in front the entire day also doesn't help in matters either. Reason number three, getting personal. Now, this is a potential content slash trigger warning, as this contains mentions of depression, passive suicidal ideation, and suicidal thoughts. If you do not feel comfortable with the following, please click off of this video right now. Thank you. Okay, now this is where things get a bit dark from here on out. This is something I have never disclosed to anyone, family members, to you, my audience, etc. I currently suffer from depression. Unfortunately, it has taken me a very long time to recognize the potential signs of this due to be thinking that this was a completely normal thing to experience in my life for the longest time. And I just want to say right here and right now that previously... I previously fought this way due to having limited knowledge on the subject of depression. I was at an age where if I was feeling really sad one day, I just simply thought it was just a mood thing or just a bad day. But now with my current new understanding of depression, I've come to realize that this kind of thing is not, nor should it ever, be considered normal in today's age. However, with all that being said, as months have went on, it has become very hard to be motivated to even engage in my favorite hobbies of the past, like video games, music, art, YouTube, etc. It's even come to a point where at times, those dark thoughts start to creep in the back of my mind. When sometimes at night when I'm trying to sleep, I suddenly think about death. Not just the concept of death itself, but also, and mainly, what happens after it. Maybe there's a heaven and hell. Or maybe there's nothing at all and it's all just infinite darkness and emptiness. Or perhaps, maybe there's a limbo where all souls, either good or bad, reside to be judged for all eternity. It's the kind of thing that keeps me up at night sometimes. But, just to make sure I don't alarm anyone or make everyone scared for my well-being, I'm doing okay. It could be better, but then again, it could be a whole lot worse. I just don't want people to view me as a kind of burden or waste of time to look after or even care for. But that's just my personal feelings and thoughts about this. 
In no way am I representing all people who suffer or may potentially be suffering from any kind of depression or other mental disorders. And another thing, in no way am I an expert on this kind of thing, just because I may suffer from it. Here are my final thoughts about all of this. I've been somewhat dreading this to make this kind of video for a while now. Mainly due to fearing what other people may think of this video or hell, maybe even me as a person. Whatever your thoughts may be, just know that I'm being 100% honest and sincere when it comes to this video. Regardless of what may happen to this video in the future or even myself, I just want to say I'm very grateful for all of you who have stuck with me this entire time and for those who have made it this far in this video. Thank you. I really do mean it when I say this. Thank you. And if you or anyone you may know is potentially showing signs or hints of inner suffering or having dark thoughts, please take it, please take it with extreme caution and care. Just because someone you know or even yourself is suffering doesn't mean you have to do it alone. Just know that most, if not all of us, have a place on this planet we call home. I'll be there in spirit to support you and cheer you on to keep going. I'll do my best to get better and become a better version of myself. You matter, and we all matter. Don't ever think of otherwise. With all this being said and done, this is Fireblade Soldiery. No. This is Jason, and I will hopefully see you all in the future.